this is Brookwood Broadcast 19, and first off, we have highlights. I'm Addie, and this is highlights. Friday is still open gym. Career day is on May, May 8th. Spring concert is on the 16th of May. There's going to be field trips coming up. 7th grade has a trip on the 20th and a second trip on the 30th. 4th grade has a trip on the 16th of May. 8th grade has a trip on May 17th. 8th grade is also having a dance and the award ceremony on the on June 4th. And the and the 8th graders are going to graduate on June 5th. And track is also happening throughout May. That's all. Bye. Thanks for the highlights. And next up is featured student slash teacher of the month. Hi, I'm here with Natalie. <laughs> and you were nominated student of the month. Does that make you feel good? I guess. <laughs> this person said Natalie is funny and can always cheer me up. She always seems to know what to say to make someone's day. How does that make you feel? Good, I guess. <laughs> wow. That's All right, bye. Okay, so now I am here with Vanessa. Um, you have been nominated for Student of the Month. How does that make you feel? Good. This person said that you were always there for me in volleyball. How does that make you feel? Good, I guess. That's good, I guess. <laughs> Hi, we're here with Alan. Good job. Anyways, why do you think you were nominated? I don't know. Well, you're wrong. Actually, the writer said that you laugh at her jokes, even when they're not funny. How does this make you feel? Good, I guess. Well, that's it for today, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, hold on. Oh. Well, that's all for today. Bye. Congratulations to the teachers and students that got selected. Next, we have Global News with Cole. Hi, I'm Cole, and welcome to Global News. For our first story, on April 15, 2019, the famous cathedral known as Notre Dame was on fire. The fire happened out of nowhere in the evening of April 15. No one knows how the fire started, but the president of France said, we will build Notre Dame. No one knows how long it will take to rebuild it. For our, ne for our next and final story, on Easter of this year, there was eight bombings spread across churches, houses, and etc. in Sri Lanka. Approximately 359 people are dead and more than 500 injured. The people who bombed these places were people who didn't like Christians, hence the reasoning for the bombings. They are still wondering if they will rebuild these churches yet. Well, that's all for Global News. Bye. There are some sad events. Next up is Real or Fake News with me and Chris. Hi, I'm Chris. And I'm Landon. And welcome to Real or Fake. Today, our first story was a body found in the Mississippi River, and the body was a 25-year-old man that was just swimming. Is this real or fake? This is fake. N our next story is about a man who claims he saw a UFO flying over his house in Austin, Texas on April 23rd. Is this real or fake? This is fake. Our third story is a kid was playing Fortnite and got second, causing it him to throw and fit and break three TVs and two windows. Is this real or fake? This is fake. Our last story is about an Australian army vehicle worth $74,000. If I went missing and was just found because it was painted camouflage. Is this real or fake? This is real. That's it for real or fake. Bye. Bye. It was hard to tell. Good job, Landon. Next up is entertainment with AJ and Joey. Hi, I'm Joey. And I'm AJ. And, and welcome, welcome to, to entertainment. entertainment. We're going to be listing our top five favorite video games of all time. My favorite game is Transformers Fall of Cybertron. I like this game because of the multiplayer customization. 
My first favorite game is Wii Sports Resort because you can fly planes and sword fight. My second game is Injustice 2. I like this game because of the, of the gear system where you can upgrade your characters so they look cooler. My second favorite video game is Apex Legends because it's a lot more realistic and better than Fortnite. My, my third favorite is Destiny 2. I like this game because of the very cool looking enemies. My third favorite game is Call of Duty Black Ops 4 because it's really cool online gameplay. My next game is Halo 5. I like this game because I can't play Call of Duty and because the enemies have lasers. My fourth favorite video game is Skyrim Elder Scrolls V Special Edition because you can get a r lot of really helpful and useful mo uh, useless mods. My favorite game of all time is Spider-Man PS4. I like this game mostly because of the amazing graphics, awesome story, and the really cool suits from different universes. My fifth and final favorite game is the Lego Star Wars C Complete Saga because it makes me happy. That's all for entertainment. Bye. Bye. My favorite video game is, of course, Candy Crush. Next, we have Technology Cor Corner with Adam and Carl. And I'm Adam. Welcome to Tech Corner. Where we discuss everything tech. A new study finalizes AirPods don't cause cancer. This is a relief for anyone with the expensive product. Nowadays, social media has taken over the planet. Facebook has reached 500 million users. Next up, big news for Apple users. That is a lot of users. About 10 million more people than one and a half times the American population. The new iPhone planned to release in September has multiple rumors stating that there will be a new charger. The new charger's purpose is to not have other companies make look-alike chargers. That is off Tech Corner. Toodles! Next, we have Featured Artists with Victor and Caden. Hello, and welcome to Featured Artists. We're your hosts, Caden and Victor. And today, uh, we have with us Bella. Hi, everyone. And we also have her unique artiste weave. So, what inspired you to make this black triangle? Um, the teacher, Miss Nussain, wanted us to try patterns, and I decided the triangle looked the easiest, so to take the easy route. Nice. Okay. Um uh what inspired you to create this? Um I guess I've always kind of been into weaving and loom stuff, so I just kind of decided to have fun and weave. Nice. Okay. Um how long did this take you? Um three or four classes. I think I was the second person in the whole art class to finish with it. That is crazy. Um, so are you are you proud of this? Um, I am very proud, and I want to show my dad since he was kind of gone when I was making it, and it's what his are, late Easter gift. So, what what are these thingies? Those are the strings that went on the weaving that she told us to just cut off the board and leave them there. So, thank you for your time. Otters is very talented. Next, we have DIY basketball skills. Hello, everyone. Today I'm here with Jackson. And today we will be DIYing some of our favorite basketball players' jump shots in the game of basketball. So let's get started. First player is LaMelo Ball. Now, he, shoot, he usually shoots from the chest with two hand release because, you know, he's not that strong. So uh, I'll demonstrate one of the shots for him. So, you know. He likes to shoot from way back here for some reason. I don't know why, but yeah, it goes like this. He usually makes it. I don't know how. We got James Harden, and since he's James Harden, we have to hit him with the step back. But he's lefty, so this is gonna be an air ball. And I have to call an ISO like Kobe real quick, cause like Kobe's a guy. So come up, call your Kobe ISO. Come up, yeah. Do some weird stuff, and then you like step back, and you're like. I can't shoot left-handed, so. Player is Julian Newman. So, since he's a short player, he's about 5'4", he usually shoots from the chest because he's not that powerful because he's short. So, his jump shot, he likes to spread his feet really wide for no reason at all, and he shoots like that. It's one of the ugliest jump shots I've ever seen, but it works. 
All right, the last one's going to be a big man, and it's Andre Drummond. But he hit a step back three the other day against the Bucks in the playoffs. So and it looks like this. He's in the post. He has something. He comes up here, and he's like... And that's all we have for DIY. Thank you. Bye. Next up, we have Fortnite Endgame with Brayden and Joey. Hi, I'm Brayden. And I'm Joey. And this is Open Topic. Today, we're going to be talking about the new Fortnite event. Fortnite is making a new game mode, kind of like the old Thanos game mode, but this one is different. This game mode is called End Endgame, which is the name of the new Marvel movie. You have to collect the stones for Thanos' gauntlet, and the Avengers have to defend the stones. The volcano is also erupting. That's right, and it's happening right now. Well, that's all. Bye. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.